They say that nature is the best healer. And that quote has been linked to the philosopher Hippocrates. Although I used to pronounce his name Hippocrates. So uh, whenever I hear anything about him, I just picture hundreds of hippos in crates, which is uh, far from natural. But is nature the best healer? Well, I would say it depends where in nature you are. Because if you wander out into the jungles, you're likely to get attacked by a crocodile. In uh, which instance the best healer then would probably be found in a hospital. But uh, let's see if nature can, can heal today. Let's go for a walk across the moor into the woods and see if nature can just heal. If nature can heal the mind, heal the body and heal the spirit. Let's go. Well, it's a summer's day here in the UK. So of course that means it's cold and wet. But even that can be healing. The cold can invigorate the cardiovascular system and the wet can hydrate the skin. So if you've got any open wounds or any open sores, I say get outside and let the rainwater flush them out. What are you looking at? I've never liked these sort of gates. I really don't like these gates at all. This, this to me is very unnatural. It looks more like something you'd find in an alien citadel. I don't like the, uh, I don't like the noise it makes. I don't like the feel of it. Very, very cold. Doesn't feel natural at all. Oh, oh, I hate this sound. Oh, I absolutely hate this sound. Oh, I can't believe there's another one. There's another gate. These things ruin the experience for me. They ruin the experience. It's uh, nature once again ruined by one of mankind's inventions of this preposterous thing. Look, oh my God, it's me. Absolutely horrendous. Oh, God. I don't feel like I'm walking in the woods. I feel like I'm working at a factory. I can imagine somebody living in there. Looks like a little hobbit's hole. Or the house of a uh, particularly big rabbit. Ow. 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 Sometimes I like to just sit and listen to the sounds of nature. That could be healing. Although, of course, these days uh, you're more likely to hear the, the roar of jet engines as they prepare for war. Or, uh, more often than not, the sound of somebody razzing around on a quad bike. fir trees are very prickly. I feel like I'm walking through a load of porcupines. Ah. Ah. 
apparently in these woods they used to have tantric sex groups that uh, they had to abandon them because of an abundance of earwigs and if you're not in the UK you don't know what an earwig is it's basically a little insect that has pincers at both ends but, uh, which sounds like one of the people who might go to uh, one of the tantric sex groups <laughs> Looks like it's going to rain again, so we'll get back to the car and uh, call it a day, I think. We'll call it a day for this walk. Ah, let's go through the pine trees and, uh, and through these as well. Ah. Well, we're back and uh, just having a little coffee slurp. <laughs> uh, this is actually mung bean coffee, which is a coffee made out of mung beans. And uh, apparently it's good for the adenoids. But you, uh, you do have to be careful with mung bean coffee, because if you have too much of it, you can get bunged up, so they say. In fact, they actually call it getting the mung bungs. So do go careful. You know, despite the uh, the cuts and the grazes all over my legs, I do feel healed. I feel as if Mother Nature has washed me from head to toe with a big flannel. I feel calm, more focused, relaxed, and uh, ready to go back into civilization. Which is a good job because I need to go into town and buy some uh, washing machine cleaner because my washing machine currently stinks. I think it's to do with the, uh, you know, the rubber ring by the main door. I think it's to do with that. So we'll be going back, back into civilization soon. But if you're feeling a little bit disconnected, if you're feeling a little bit confused and distressed with life, just go outside in nature, no matter what the weather, Go outside and see for yourself. Realise that nature can heal. See you next time. Mm -hmm.